farmer input support program continues to face hurdles of progress in the 2022-2023 farming season. Delay by government to award tenders to the suppliers of farm inputs is revealing its ripple effects on the ground. With the desperation to get inputs, some farmers and public officers are reported to have been involved in bribes in Kasama district of northern province. We are putting money in our ATC forms so that we can quicken the process. Otherwise, if you don't do that, you can even take forever without getting the inputs. Some of us were unable to put money there, and you discover that we are spending more days here because we do not have money to give the depot clerks. We want the anti-corruption to do something about this. Northern Province Agriculture Coordinator says his office has engaged relevant agencies to investigate the allegations, but no such report has come forth. The, the allegations are not proven. Several times we have made an attempt to investigate. At one time I went with the provincial administration, the director of finance and the other members of staff. We could not trace any. At a later stage, I even involved the OP, and they have also involved the Anti-Corruption Commission, of which the provincial head has sent a number of officers there. But up to now, we, do, we are not receiving that report. In Kazungula district of southern province, farmers remain unhappy with the delays to collect their inputs. <laughs> We've been here in Livingstone for three weeks and we've not been attended to. Now that we've been attended to, there's only decompound fertilizer and there's no urea. What are we supposed to do? Our children are suffering. The communication between the people that are providing the imports and ourselves is not clear. What are we expected to do? However, in each part of the city of Eastern Province, the situation is different as farmers are smoothly getting the inputs from the sheds without many challenges. Our cooperative has been able to collect the inputs. We didn't have so many challenges. A few challenges are at cooperative level because we got a few parts, so we are sharing the bags. We can't complain in terms of redeeming the inputs here at the shed. We didn't have so many challenges. But the delay by government to start this process is what has resulted for us to be here at this time. Urea, which was area a challenge, has been delivered and farmers are redeeming slightly. Over 1 million farmers are benefiting from the Farmer Input Support Program in Zambia. Samo, Sylvester Kwawe, Damo News, Eastern Province.